in a world searching for gaming knowledge comes the man, the myth, a legend in his own mind, Critical. Welcome back guys and gals, Critical here. Today I'm bringing an episode of subsistence on my softcore world. And before we even take one step out of this door, I do have my level 4 shotgun on me. Alright, I've heard you, you guys are right. That was really, really stupid. Why do I have three things of meat on me? Hold on. Oh, what's my power real quick? Oh, I'll leave that on, just let it... Just let it increase my power. What I have on me is supplies I want to bring to my other base. Now, I don't need that base over there, but I like it for the... The water that I can uh, get out of the ground over there. It's also nice for the extra planter. And it's just a little hideaway, something I can... I can, as a way station, I can just pull over there and go, hey, let's just take a break. 28. Oh, wow, I've got all our arrows. I just take a break over there and I don't have to be harassed. I've got some place I can hide and lick my wounds, per se. But the hunters keep attacking it. I got attacked twice yesterday when I was just doing some grind uh, off screen uh, gameplay. And they attacked twice, and both times they were attacking my other base. So, I'm I'm wondering if that thing is going to be in shambles. I don't know why they keep attacking it. I mean, I'm not really upset about it. I almost prefer that they, they, they attack over there as a retaliation attack than attacking my main base. And but my ba my main base is already set up to. Uh, mitigate the damage that these hunters can do and god I need to get ores oh but you know level 2 cougar all right I got a wolf down there I gotta get this set up correctly all right I got a nice hill you have to run up to me come on you know I want to try something real quick if I can actually hit this stupid thing how many arrows does it take to kill a cougar? Let's find out. I've never tried before. I'm thinking four. Four regular arrows will take down a level two cougar. Now, as long as you have a nice clear runway and enough stamina to do this, it might be worth it. I don't know. But if I run into a bear or a wolf or, you know, heaven forbid, rogue hunters, I'm I'm Fubar. You can stop, but I'm still gonna shoot you. Uh yeah, it looks like two more. At least two more. Maybe even three. And that one I'm pretty sure was close to his head. I also like how he didn't run directly at me. He ran to the side, thereby giving me a chance to just turn around and run back the same way that I just came. Did he, does he actually have a stamina? Because he stopped a lot sooner that time. Wow, he really stopped. Okay. Oh, I missed. Pick up that medical plant. Let's see if he, st Let's see if he stops again really quickly. Because he didn't run as far as he did the first time. Yeah, he's definitely got a stamina thing, guys. So it's going to be five arrows. I mean, this does feel kind of... I mean, it's still it's still not safe. Nobody can say this is safe because I don't know what I'm going to run into on the other side. In fact, I'm going to turn a little bit, make a slow turn, and head back. Looks like he got a second win because he's still following now. Oh yeah, at least two more. Oh no, three more! Oh, I missed! Oh! 
Okay, it takes too many arrows. <laughs> That's how many <laughs> arrows it takes. Too many. But I, I was like, you know what? This isn't fair. I got to give this, this cougar a chance. And he definitely got a chance. He just about took me out. I only need one. Wow, that was funny. I thought for sure I was gonna, I was gonna be, you know, sitting there messing around with a cougar and I was gonna get killed. But at least it would have been on screen, right? Now, I am, I am definitely jacked right now because I just got finished doing a hardcore episode and to be that close to death, um, yeah, it gives you, I mean, hardcore gives you a whole new appreciation for this game. Seriously, you really have to, okay, I'm in a softcore world. I, I can die and, it, and it's not the end of, basically, end of the world. I wonder what that bear was doing. It looked like he was making some weird motions or something. You okay, bear? Don't want to mess with you. You're a grizzly, I think. Pretty sure you're a grizzly. Um, oh, another cougar. All right, we're not going to play around with the cougar again. I'll, if, I will take the cougar out, but I am not going to give it a chance to uh, eat me. Not like the last time. What level are you? Oh, you're at level one. And I have my boomstick. Come here, level one. There we go. Don't anticipate the cougar is going to be coming up. Just wait till it's right in front of you. Oh, nice. 11 more sinew. All right, I'm doing really good on sinew. Let's reload just in case. It is possible to have more than two cougars on a map. Now, it's not that there'd be three cougars spawned in. I think if I see another cougar, it would be... Uh, another spawn of a, of a cougar, meaning the cougar would spawn back in. All right, we're almost to the old place. Yes, yes. The the wolves are are happy to see me. That's that's them cheering and and uh, uh, welcoming their lord and savior back to the to his home. Really, that means they want to eat my face. Let's just be honest. Uh, is that another crate up there? No. Okay, it's just a rock. All right, so how bad is this beat up? Yeah, they're they're beating this place up pretty bad. Now that it's protected, it's not as bad as it was. But I'm gonna leave supplies here to. Oh, my generator's damaged. I think they actually threw the grenade directly in here. Oh yeah, they definitely they. They're lobbing the grenades directly in. That's what's doing all this damage. All right. That, that changes things. We are going to, do I have, I don't have what I need. Oh my god, look at this. They're lobbing grenades all the way up here, too. The, 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 they never used to do this when I was living here. I don't know if it was the uh, small amount of fencing I had before, or what, but... And that's all the wood that I brought. I mean, that was a good amount of wood. And I still have this one just about to break. Holy crud. Oh, man, this thing is getting beat. Okay. This has got to get moved. It's got a grow light on it. Oh, they took my solar panel out. It, I moved it back here already. Ah. All right. That's it. I'm done. This place is getting... To, uh, I am taking this place apart. Now that there's no solar panel here... Nah, I'm taking it apart. So everything I brought with me and all the resources I just wasted, I kind of wish I could get back because, yeah, I am done and over with this with this base here. I am going to wait until... Here, I'll feed you. I'll wait until this planter produces all the tomatoes and I'm going to take everything. And the next time I'm up here, I'm taking this place apart. Yeah. 
Alright, let's now tank these canteens back. I want to leave one space open. I'll take the water. And I'll let it finish extracting. Might as well use up the fuel to make sure it can extract and then that can continue to grow. But yeah, they're they're just manhandling this place. They're I don't know where they're attacking from. Maybe they're attacking from the other side and throwing grenades this way. They never used even before I had the the kind of a fencing over here, they could never get the grenades up there. But it's it, it appears as though now they're actually tossing them from either here or over here. Cause yeah. Now I'm pissed. They took out a solar panel. These damn hunters owe me a You know what? I'm gonna go back. I'm gonna make some I've got 14 minutes left. I'm gonna go drop everything off and I'm gonna go kill the hunters. I am pissed. They took out a solar panel. What was that? A tomato seed. Uh, that actually is one of those things I want to eat. Took a chance. Just, I could still get sick. Now, I did the testing and it is very rare that you'll get sick from eating uh, beef, red meat, but it is possible. But I had an antidote on me, so I really wasn't cool. Damn. I might have a wolf following me, I don't know yet. No, I don't. Will you let me get this one too? What if I, what if I, 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 surrender and I and I'm down low and I'm not threatening in any way shape or form nope he didn't care ah, I should have just kept turning I would have been all right stupid wolf got more than enough meat I don't need you I shall be stupid me for allowing the wolf to ever get that close right Ah, oh, 15 blueberries. Um, what can I, you know, two more fiber and I can make, ah, here we go. Fill that spot up. Actually. And. Who was that? Ammo casings and cordage. Oh, I'm dropping the cordage. That's right. I'm just going to drop it, aren't I? So now I'm just dropping the fiber. Uh, You know, that stuff, I think I'm just going to have to leave it. I'm not going to waste the livers. They're too useful. <laughs> yes, I picked up a I can't help it. I'm still going to pick up fiber. And it's just going to fall away. Do I have any or no, I don't have any ores on me, so I can't pick up any ores on the way home. I think next time, I need to make a note for myself. The next time that I play this offline, I need to spend the entire day getting nothing but ores. I'm going to come over to this rock over here and just keep going around the area. Because there's a lot of ores over here. Still thinking about going up to the hunters. I have to make some more first aid kits. Ah, damn it! I just heard the hammering when uh, I went over the hill. No, 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 no. I jumped up into that one. No, no, no. Stupid rogue hunters. Where are you at? Reload. I only have one bandage. I'm not going to use it unless I need it. Whoa. More rogue hunters here. Come on. Come on. Ah. No, 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 no. Making damage. All right. Had to heal. 
I'm done. With that. Body shots. I'm not just going for the head anymore. Come on, stop moving. Ah. Not planned. Not happy. Alright, leave the fiber. Oh, I want the wood. That's free wood. I'll eat the liver. Doesn't matter. Oh, more ore, more wood. They've got good loot. I mean, I like this loot. Um, I can't get away. Cannot get rid of the medical plants. Oh, I can make a bandage. There we go. Nope, I need that bandage. Um, one round, I'm going to leave the one round, but I want that copper. I'm not sick either. Wow. Um, oh, here we go. I wish I'd seen this earlier. Mixed berry water. There we go. Reload my weapon. There's... Okay, that's the other hunter on the other side over there. I'm gonna reload all my weapons real quick. Okay, they didn't create any space. But okay. Well, I might as well find their fire and grab the ash out of it real quick. Yeah, that 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 scared me. <laughs> Remember, I'm 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 still got hardcore on the brain. And they were hiding a lock chest. Those bastards. No wonder I haven't seen any locked chests. They've had them all. Alright. They lose their ash. That's fine. Alright. We need to get back home. I've got way too much stuff on me to die. I only have one first aid kit and one bandage. So I will not be raiding the hunters. You know, I really need to do... I think the next the next episode... I, before the next episode, I need to go on a grind for medical plants again ores and then I need to make first aid kits I need to get back up to having 10 bandages and 10 first aid kits <laughs> yes I can't help myself I have to pick up the fiber even though I'm automatically going to drop it as soon as I pick up I can't help it it's ingrained in me to pick up the fiber guest take fiber So yeah, then so between the between the uh, episodes, I'm gonna go demolish my old place because it's no longer as useful as it used to be. It lost its solar panel. I'm going to, and everything's about to break up there, and it just the resources just to keep fixing it make no sense when I already have a place down here that it's much easier to defend. Now that means we're gonna get a lot more attacks at the main base, but that could be fun, you know. Put that in there. I am just going to put everything into a dump test real quick. Make you guys watch all this. Let's get rid of it. Come over here. I'll use this as a last bit drop chest. Eat all. It and take four with me and drink one. Okay. I want to get back out there and uh, get going. One, two, three. One, two, three, four, five bandages at least. Five first aid kits. Okay. Maybe I will go mess with the hunters. I've got five first aid kits, five bandages. And a lot of ammo. I'm going to leave my shotgun behind. Do I have any hand grenades left? I do. All right.
This might be stupid. <clears throat> what time is it? Okay. You know what time it is, boys and girls. It's time to mess with the hunters again. They keep attacking my bases. They're rogue buddies. Ambush me on my way home. And I was minding my own business and I wasn't causing any trouble. They started this. I'm coming to finish it. Ah, damn it, I should have taken the shot. Now he's got a helmet on. Oh, you're gonna go after, damn it. I have to get around from this side, don't I? There we go. <laughs> I've gotten good at doing that, and I love doing it. I tried to do a stutter step there to try to confuse his shot for a second. Oh, no, 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 no. Don't want to surround me. Come on. Where are you at? Oh, they're hiding behind the tree. Dome shot. I love when they have a shotgun out. You were cutting wood, so you should have wood on you. Oh, no? Okay. All right, I'm gonna run back home. I'm gonna grab a couple supplies because I think I'm gonna try spending the night in their base again and screw with both camps first thing in the morning. No mess with me, wolf. I wanted, I jumped twice there to try to avoid an attack because I was coming so close to his turn, he was I was almost sure he was gonna hit me. And if he didn't hit me, I would've been really shocked. Run, chicken! I've got wolves on my tail. Alright. Um, I'll take a liver because I can cook it. That, that. Um, I'm gonna grab some supplies. Stack of metal, perfect. I don't know how much power they're gonna have, but I'm gonna try something here. Why does this look like it's damaged? Okay, it's not. Freaking me out, I'm like, why is that damaged? Take a couple apples. I've got some eggs and I got some meat I can cook over there. Ah, I'm locking myself in. It's like, my, my myself's like, no, don't do this. This is a bad idea. And I'm like, no, I'm going to do it because I think it's an awesome idea. All right, two level one wolves. I'm just going to run between them, split the difference. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're both going to charge me. I don't care. Reload on the run, which is actually nice. If you can do that. Oh, a building crate. I'm gonna have to run past it. That wolf's right on my butt. I thought the wolf was just gonna be standing there. I was like, okay, well now you have to die. Now, the last time I did this, I aggroed the other base while I was standing here, so I need to be careful. Because it's very, I don't know why, but it's very easy for me to aggro when you're so close. Oh no, one of them screwed up. How much ammo do I have? All right, well, I'm gonna pause and I'll bring you guys back when I get in here, okay? All right, we're just about to get in here. It's gonna be just in the nick of time, too. Oh, nice. Thanks, guys, I appreciate it. Oh, oh, looks like they saw me. Oh, this fire's still going, huh? From the last time I was up here. Or does it, now that it's it's lit, does it automatically light? Let's, I'm gonna have to wait and see on this. I'm gonna tear that. Make a bandage or two. 
Yeah, see, I aggroed that other when I when I walked in. Oh, okay. Um, do I have? Oh, I should have brought sinew with me. I could have made a hand grenade. Okay. Lesson learned. Take a little sinew with me so I can uh, make hand grenades. But I will be making some ingots. Use their power. Awesome. Oh, I can also make some casings. Yes, it does. So, okay, guys, I don't own this, but I was able to turn it on. So if you light a fire in a hunter's base, the, that fire will continue to stay lit, just like their fire does. It just continues to stay lit over and over again. So that's cool. That's actually useful information because you can use their their place to build and stuff. I mean, to uh, to cook in case you if you get inside. And um, once you're doing what I'm doing, there's really no reason to. But I still think it's fun. Oh, they're t they're they're probably going for the revenge attack on my base. <laughs> question is which base are they attacking they're attacking my other base because they're so far away I can't hear it oh well it's dark it's middle of the night let's split and eat and eat I'll eat that and then I'll go ahead and finish uh, staying here for the night and then I'll bring you guys back in the morning in the next episode and we'll mess with the hunters. I am Critical. This has been Subsistence on Softcore. I hope you guys have enjoyed this content and I'll see you in the next video. Take it easy. Bye.